So over here you can see that I got a Jamboard project opened up and I might have made a lot of changes to this. And sometimes you might want to just restore out an older version of file. So to do that, you can use something called version history option and then replace out uh, with an old file or just see how um, the old version of files look. So to do that, I'm going to go around over here on to the more actions panel. And then you can see that C version history is an option. Once you click on it, what happens is that the version history opens up and you'll be able to see the version history. So let's say for example, here in July 24 in 12, uh, 18 p.m. you can see the version history right here. So this is how it looked. Then over here in Friday, this is how it looked right here. So this is how it looked on Thursday and so forth as you can see right here. So I've made a lot of changes to this document as you can see. You can also re to restore out the version over here. You can also show the uh, version history uh, list of the name files only, only the named uh, version history. In that case, it says no name versions. Let's say you want to go around and then rename this out. Let's say I'm going to go around over here onto this version history and I'm going to rename it as picture. I can do that over here. I can go around and say this one is a logo and this one is text right here. So three of them are named out and this is especially helpful if you have a lot of version history out there. So if you were to click on this one, what happens is that it'll only show out the named version histories right there. So you'll be able to click on one and then you can go to more action, you can restore the version, you can remove the name out as well if you don't want to, keep it, and then it gets removed out. You can make a copy of the version history as well. So once you click on make a copy, another copy of the file is made out um, and the original version stays as it is and then you, you only have access to that version right here as another copy of the file as well. So over here, there's other option over here. So you can restore out the version as well. So for example, for the text, I want to restore out this particular version. Then I can click on this one or click on restore this version right here. And it says your current document will revert to the version name text right here. So restore it out and then the uh, original file will, will be replaced. So you can create another copy of the version history or replace out the original file according to how you like it. And that is how you can use the C version history option um, and then uh, utilize it to restore out your uh, history files inside of Google Jamboard. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.